Spurs hosting the Warriors. The Warriors are eight-point road favorites. The over-under is now 228. The Warriors are minus 360 on the money line, and the Spurs are plus 290. These are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. They've played each other three times this season. Warriors took two out of three. 118, 112 in Golden State. 126, 113 in uh, the Spurs won that one in uh, Golden State. And then the Warriors won 112, 102. I'm still just a little thrown because I just wrote down the over under at 226 and a half and it's already gone up a point and a half. It's crazy how that just changes just like that. For the lineups, it's supposed to be Curry, Thompson, Wiggins, Kuminga, and Green. And both Thompson and Kuminga are listed as questionable. Then Jones, Vassal, Champagne, Osman, or Osman, and Wembenyama. Lineups have not been confirmed. That's just who's supposed to be there. Head to head, the road team's on a two game winning streak. The road team is 7 and 3. The Warriors are 7 and 3. The underdog is 7 and 3 against the spread. The favorite is 6 and 4 on the money line. The under is 5, 4, and 1. And if you bet this game like 10 minutes ago, the over under was at 226 and a half, and it was 6 and 4. Now, the over under is 5 and 5 at 228. So that one point did, one and a half points did make a difference in this uh, outcome here. The Warriors are 6-4 in their last 10, 6-4 against the spread. The under is 6-4 in their last 10. They've won and covered their last three. All those games went under. There's a total of 224, 205, 194, and then 212. Losing by four to the T-Wolves, then beating the Heat by 21, then beating the, the Magic by 8, and then the Hornets by 18. All of those games were on the road. For the Spurs... They are 4-6 in their last 10, 6-4 against the spread. The under is 6-4. They also have won and covered their last three. 3-1 three in their last four. 237, 206, 229, and then 256. Losing by 25 to the Suns, then beating the Suns by 2, then beating the Jazz by 7, and then beating the Knicks by 4. I will take the Warriors with the money line. I'll take the Spurs getting the points, and I'm going to go over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.